Let's go guys, it's Raul TV, Team R4UL, your favourite YouTube mechanic, back again. And what I'm doing now is I've got a 2012 Citroen DS3 and we're going to go ahead and replace the rear coil spring. Okay, the rear coil spring. I've already took the wheel off, I'm not going to show you how to take the wheel off. Because if you don't know how to take the wheel off, don't even attempt this job, okay? The easiest job ever, right, to replace the coil spring. Easy, easy job. It takes no more than 10 minutes. Okay, it's pretty much like a shock absorber replacement on Polo that I did previously, um, but this one even easier. You don't, you need basically one tool to take it off. Okay, let's go, let's do it. Okay, so first things first, I've took the wheel off. I mean, I'm not going to show you how to take the wheel off. You guys should know that by now. Let's take the wheel off. So we've took the wheel off. We're going to go around to this side here. I've got the jack on it, okay, to support it. I'm going to go in there, through that hole there. And we've got a Torx there. We need to take that Torx off. Okay, so what we need is an E18. That's an e Echo 18 Torx. Okay, we're gonna get it in there. Okay, and all we do is just basically anti clockwise. Let's go ahead and take that off. Okay, after the bolt comes off, as you can see, that it's in there. If you want to, you can just leave it there if you want or get a magnet and just take it out with a magnet that's what i would recommend just take it out with a magnet so then it, 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 you won't go missing or if you can get just get your fingers in there and take it off with your fingers basically we have to take that bolt out from there bolt comes straight out sometimes what happens is it could spin on this side okay if that plate here messes up it could spin um if it does spin then obviously um just take that plate off and it's a little nut there as you can see there 16 or 17 mil nut that comes off so what we're doing now is we just lower the jack hopefully spring should come off replace it with a new one okay so let's take this lower the jack take the tension off the spring you can see there it's off the shock absorber there happy days let's go okay there we go shock absorber's off there what we'll do now is lower it totally. It should be off anyway. There we go. There's no tension on that spring. That will come straight off. Let's go. Okay, there we have it. Spring comes off. All we have to do is obviously pull it down a little bit and then the spring comes straight out. Make sure the rubbers are still there. Let's get the new one on. There we have it. New spring is on. I'll be straight up honest with you. If you're doing it by yourself, you're better off just taking both sides off, okay, and then supporting it with a jack. Okay, if, because I've got my brother here, he pulled the, the the axle down, okay, and I got the spring in there. I mean, or get a bar, pull it down with a bar, and get a spring, uh, get the spring in there. Um, either way, two people will make it a lot easier. So one person pulls the the uh, hub down, the axle down, the, the other person basically gets the spring in. Happy days. Uh, let's fit it in reverse order. Get that bolt in, and that's about it. Get the wheel on. Job done. Well, that is it guys, that's how we replace the rear coil spring on a Citroen DS3 2012-13 kind of thing. Dead, dead easy. Like I mentioned, take one bolt off and that's it, you're good to go. A uh, little bit, the only hardest thing is taking the bolt off, okay? Sometimes it can be seized, seized up. Besides that, if it's not seized up, comes off, job done. The other un hard thing is you need to pull it down, okay? Pull the rear axle down, so get a helper pull the rear axle down, get the spring off, happy days. Anyway guys, hope this video helps you guys out. If it didn't help you guys out, I'm sorry, try my best. Team R for UL, you tr we're trying to hook you guys up. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell button for me. Leave a comment in the comment section. Raul TV, we'll see you guys next time.